Well, I think it's a shame that the Justice Department has targeted Sheriff Joe Arpaio, the sheriff of Maricopa County in Arizona. I've been to visit his operation. I've gone out to his tent city to see what kind of a job that he does. He takes great pains to make sure that he doesn't discriminate against people based on race. Um, there is not a profiling operation going on down there that I can see, but I can see that this administration, and before Barack Obama was elected, there was a partisan effort to try to bring the forces to bear against Joe Arpaio for, for reasons that they oppose enforcement of immigration law. That's the left, that's La Raza, that's Maldef, and that's the open borders crowd. So now they bring political pressure against Joe Arpaio. Already Janet Napolitano has canceled his 287G program, which was the program that let Maricopa County work and cooperate with ICE and the federal government on enforcement of immigration law. Now they bring this report. This, I believe, has a political agenda that's working against a man who stands up for the law, who's endorsed, by the way, Governor Perry for president because Governor Perry's position on immigration. So I defend Joe Arpaio. I think he needs to continue with the tent city, and I think the Department of Justice should not be using themselves as a tool, a political tool, to push back against people that are working to enforce the law.